Hey everyone, let's go ahead and take a look at this last problem. So Mark and Don are planning to sell each of their marble collections at a garage sale. If Don has one more than three times the number of marbles that Mark has, how many does Don have to sell if the total number of marbles is 113? All right, so if we start to hear this, Mark and Don have some marbles and they're each gonna sell them at a garage sale. And we basically wanna figure out how many marbles each of them has. So I've got two variables here. I can see, I'm gonna call M is gonna be the number of marbles that Mark has. And then I'm gonna let, we'll go D for Don. It's gonna be the number of marbles that Don has. And since I have two variables, I need two equations. So let's see what we've got. We've got that Don has one more than three times the number of marbles Mark has. So more implies addition, times implies multiplication. So one of my equations is gonna say that Don has one more than three times the number of marbles that Mark has. So D is equal to one plus three M. Okay, and then the other thing I hear is that the total number of marbles that they have between them is 113. So whatever Mark has and whatever Don has, when we total them out together, when we add them, that's gonna be 113. So I've got my two equations and my two unknowns, and what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna substitute, oops, maybe that's not the best pen color, let me go with orange. I'm gonna substitute D into this equation so that I only have one variable and one equation, and then I can solve for M. So let's do that. So instead of, and I'll just do it over here. I start with M plus D equaling 113. Oh my goodness, whoa, that was fun. Hold up, wait for it, wait for it, we're back. I don't even know what I did, that's always fun. Okay, so like I said, instead of D here, I'm gonna substitute in one plus three M. So this is gonna be M plus, right? We had one plus three M for the substitution. It's equal to 113, so we're looking at M plus one plus three M is equal to 113. So on the left side there, I have 4m plus one is equal to 113. If I subtract one, I'm gonna get that 4m is equal to 112. And if I divide both sides by four, I am going to get, what do we have? M is, that's gonna be, I think, 28. Okay, and let's see what they were asking. It says, how many does Don have? So at this point, I've only found marks. So if I wanna find Don, then I'm gonna go and substitute again, but this time, oops, let me redraw that. Oh, and let me use my orange. I'm gonna substitute that M right here. So let's try this now. So instead of D equaling one plus three M, we're gonna do D equals one plus three times 28. So if I crunch that, that's gonna be one plus 84 which is gonna be 85. And the units on both of these are marbles because this is how many marbles these two fellas have. So if we take a look at that, it looks like Don has 85 and my answer is D. All right, thanks so much everyone, bye.